Oh, hi, I'm Mark Turner, President of the Gilroy Chamber of Commerce, and here's what's coming up this week, the week of July 25th. Well, we're at Predators Archery uh, in downtown. They're new members of the chamber, and at Predators, they do sales, repair, and lessons. You can come and learn about uh, bow hunting, how to shoot bow and arrow. Uh, be sure to check them out. You can check them out online or stop by downtown here and visit them in person. Well, other things coming up around the chamber are the, uh, of course, later this week, we have the Garlic Festival beginning on Friday. You want to be sure to come on out. Stop by one of the beer gardens, visit with us, buy a couple of beers. We'd certainly appreciate that. And then coming up on August 12th, it's our Government Relations Committee meeting. We're going to have a representative from Silicon Valley Clean Energy explaining that whole, uh, that whole situation there. So be sure to come check that out, learn more about that. It's a program that uh, certainly for businesses, residents, they will have to opt out of that program if they don't want to be involved in it. So you will learn more on, at that uh, GRC meeting. Then, of course, you've been hearing a lot about the Urban Growth Boundary Initiative. That's something we strongly encourage you to learn more about. You can go to the city website and actually read the 9212 report. If nothing else, you want to read the executive summary. It really begins to spell out just how bad the Urban Growth Boundary Initiative, if implemented, would be for Gilroy. It'll be bad for jobs. It'll be bad for infrastructure, bad for city revenue. It'll be bad for jobs uh, creation and business attraction overall. The Urban Growth Boundary Initiative is bad for Gilroy. So we encourage you to read that and learn about it and become educated and vote on that issue in the fall. Well, that does it for now. Hope to see you around town. I really hope to see you out at the Garlic Festival. I'm Mark Turner with the Gilroy Chamber of Commerce.